Okay, once again we have another burner mission and once again we are flying Hatelesses at Unified Mergal, Nergal. Um, so this is the Sancha burner. So all I'm going to do is pick the Sancha burner fit here. Hit fit ship and it will swap the modules already. Um, and then our destructions for this are nice and simple on Eve Workbench. Remember, um, link below will be for the for this particular setup here, which has all of the links for all of the burner fits. Uh, the links inside to all of the individual fits. This is the link for all of the stuff you need to do, and then you have the YouTube for hatelessy stuff as well. Um, so. The destructions are as follows. Approach the succubus and start shooting as soon as possible. Overheat the web to catch them. Let it cycle twice so that the new orbit can settle and then turn off the heat. Um, and don't use drones. So, that's the instructions. Let's get on with it. We accept the mission. We are fit up. We don't need drones. We do need Mystic, I believe. Yep, so let's get the Mystic loaded from the cargo bay. It says it can't be fitted to any of the currently done modules. Oh, it can't because this Mystic, for some reason, is medium size. So let me put that away. Don't know why that was on the cargo hold. But there we go. So light Mystic fitted. Let's head over to this site. Okay, we are at the warp gate. So harden her on. I don't know why it started going there. Maybe I pressed the key, I'm not sure. But in we go. Nice and simple target approach. Get the stuff on and then start the reps. So this is almost always cap stable in every circumstance. Um, so we don't need to worry about that, we just need to worry about some of the initial... Oh, there we go. I actually lost the web. So we need to worry a little bit about some of the initial damage. But we just overheat the two of those. Uh, just because somebody didn't know it last time. Uh, if you hit shift and click, you can overheat as opposed to going for the little tiny, tiny green bit on the top. So we are shifting, we are clicking, we are overheating and we are approaching. And then just letting it build. And I'm just going to knock that off for a little while. I think that should be enough to run us. Nope, he's gotten out again. So I've got to keep that on. Yeah, this could do with a little bit of work. I'm actually going to overheat the gun. Try and burn through that a little bit faster. There we go. Everything off so I don't burn out anything. And we are approaching the wreck. So not the greatest, requires a little bit of overheating skills in general. And remember for the tanking ability, I'll show it every time. These are the mods that I've got in, so I've got armor repping mods. Um, so I have a, a phenomenal amount of armor rep over the top of standard because I'm using low grade ASCII plans. Yeah, not a good loot this time. But remember and always loot the burner missions because they usually work out as something fairly good. So back to the station, cash it in, and that's us. Nice and simple mission, fantastic fit once again. Um, and just keep an eye on that. You're overheating when you're doing that. Good to have the skills for it. Alright, so back at the station, and we just turn in our mission. For some reason my clicks are not registering. There we go. So 12,000, that's not a certain normal moment, but this is a low standing agent. Um, I've got 6.2 standings towards the agent and I think I've got 0.6 standing towards R, 0.7 standing now, um, towards Amar Empire. 
So normally you'd expect this with a good standing to be about 15,000, which is what I've got roughly for Sisters of Eve. So thanks for watching. I hope that was helpful. Bye.